Hello, I'm Ron Vale, and I'd like to tell you about a course that James Frazier and I organized for UCSF graduate students. The course was called Engineering Life, and it was custom designed based upon lectures that are on the iBiology website. In Engineering Life, we covered a whole variety of topics, uh, starting from the origin of life on Earth, to protein and DNA design, to metabolic engineering, and finally, tissue engineering and drug delivery. And uh, this is really just an example of many kinds of courses that you could put together based upon material on the iBiology website. Now let's hear more about how the course was organized from two students in the course. Hi, I'm Taz Vitte. I'm a third year MD-PhD student currently in the Neuroscience Graduate Program. I'm Ben Barsigarian. I'm a first year Tetrad student. We want to tell you a little bit about a class we just took. So first, the structure. Before class every day, we would do some homework. The first thing we would do is watch an intro lecture given by an expert in a particular field, like synthetic biology or tissue engineering. After the intro lecture, we would watch a research talk about that PI's ongoing research. We would also read a paper about that research. And finally, we would prepare some answers to discussion questions that were generated by students in the class who took ownership over that material. These student leaders uh, facilitated a discussion that was wide-ranging and uh, talked about things from applications of the research to biomedical science and to medicine in general. It also allowed us to have an interesting discussion about big picture science and think about big picture when it comes to our own research and what we want to do in the future. What I really enjoyed about the course was that I went from knowing nothing about a field to being able to read and understand an in-depth research article uh, faster than I ever have before. Something I really liked about the class was watching experts in a given field tell us about their research and tell us about that field. And it was really interesting to see how they communicated both for a lay audience in their intro topics and their intro lectures, and also to graduate students in their research talks. As instructors, we also loved this class. One of the things that we loved about it was that the students really took ownership of the class. Um, they were very well prepared in advance. They liked listening to these lectures. Uh, they liked reading the papers. And what was particularly impressive uh, were the student discussion leaders. They really uh, looked at this material very carefully and prepared a very set, uh, good set of thoughtful questions to lead the class in discussion. In fact, most of the time, during class time, the discussion was generated entirely by the students. And James and I only occasionally had to guide the conversation. The other thing that I liked about this class is it kind of broke down the barriers between who was a student and who was a teacher. Uh, all of the subject matters that we discussed were not the areas of research uh, that James and I are involved in. So we were students as much as the, uh, the UCSF students were. Uh, and we were all in here together learning this material uh, as a group. So I think that made this class a lot of fun uh, for all of us. So I would say overall this flipped classroom using iBiology uh, lectures uh, was a giant success and I would encourage you to use uh, material from this engineering life course or develop another course uh, of interest to you.